Welcome back to the solo playthrough of Chinstrap Trap Lost Planet 3. Here we go. Uh, I don't think we can go this way. What? We're stuck in the middle of another flashback. Be able to swim across this. Okay, so now what? Well, if you're up for it, we can try cutting through that hotel. Why does it have to be so fucking noisy every single time I start playing? Like, there's water running, there's people stomping around upstairs. Ugh. I apologize for all the ambient noise I've got going on around here. It's imperfect, but I do it in the studio so everybody will leave me alone. <laughs> it's really it. I'm sorry, I didn't see what she said, but there's going to be a way around. Yeah, that's annoying. Yeah, the water meter's running. I'm sorry. I've noticed that in the other episodes, but there's nothing I can do about it. So, in the moments where I'm not talking, I'm just going to probably cut my audio. something you think you can fit in there well, it's worth a shot <laughs> careful now yep <laughs> I'm through hold on all right Uh, looking. Well, hello. Howdy. You impressed? Nope. You're just too skinny. You need to eat more. <laughs> You're welcome. That's rude. Jesus Christ, come on. You're gonna roll around all your shit. Ugh. Ugh. I hate it. I just. <laughs> just lucky I'm not recording in anything important. I'd be like, oh my god. <laughs> just so much noise. Like, it's surprising how much noise gets into here. It's ridiculous. This place is giving me the creeps. And she's stomping around. Ugh. Water meter stop running finally. I think I see a way through, but we got spores. Put your mask on. Oh, do I have to? It's just us. What if we run into someone? Okay, fine. Come on, man. The Rona. Put your mask on. I went out today and I put a mask on because I'm not a dipshit. And eventually you're going to slip up in front of someone you shouldn't. I've never slipped. You ain't told nobody, do, have you? Not Jesse or Dina or... Of course not. Okay, good. Oh my god. With all this noise, like, I can't wait till I live by myself. <laughs> have you ever been in here before? God. Dogs are running around, my mom's just rolling shit around, the water meter's running. Maybe. Sorry, I've been kind of in a bad mood the past couple of days. <laughs> I enjoy playing this. It's nice. Just kind of fucking escape a little bit into more terror and angst and misery. 
but at least it distracts me from <laughs> all the shit going on in real life. Not that I've got anything bad going on necessarily. Worst thing I got is that I haven't been able to see my girlfriend in three months. That's <clears throat> really the only bad thing. Stomp, 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 stomp. I gotta get some like padded floors or something. Stop and back and forth. Stop it. What did the last patrol go through here? What are we doing? We're trying to get the guitar strings, right? I mean, I know that's important, but many people went missing from Jackson and teenagers from last year. This one's too old. Now it just roamed in. Stop! Stomping! I know I'm gonna be complaining about that the whole time, but seriously, it's like. Well, let me go to the to the kitchen. Like Jesus. All right. <laughs> See what I mean? Like it's annoying. <laughs> it's annoying. I'm sorry for our patrol over all you yesterday. We don't run into new people too often. I understand why you might have been nervous to follow us to Jackson, but it really is a nice place. Good electricity, good crops, could be something special for you and your family. My boys are different people here. Before Jackson, we were so focused on just staying alive, I didn't like who they were becoming. They started acting like the people we were running away from. These days, they're on roofs fixing holes, digging trenches. Hard work, but they come home every night excited about building up this place. They've got community, a reason to be accountable. You used to be a teacher. You could have a classroom of kids hungry for knowledge. This isn't a fantasy. Please consider just stopping by. Let me show you around. Tara. Here, strong. Is that her fucking name? I forget. It's a voice actress. Take those. Why would you put those in the shower? This one. Wouldn't it be nice if they give you all this ammo, but there's never a reason to use it? Come here. What the fuck do you want? <gasps> they are on the patrol, right? Okay. Let's take them out. Imagine this just being your day to day, you know? Okay, I had it. I had it. I'll let you take care of that then. Why? You got infinite ammo, you're like the solid snake of this game. Nice work. I helped. Oh my god. There's a hand there. Why is there a hand there? That is disgusting. There's actually quite a few of them. Holy shit. <laughs> Joel had it under control. He's OP as shit. <laughs> I wonder if they did that intentionally. Probably, right? Because we were so busy playing as Joel <clears throat> in the first game when we were killing everything.
All right, I'm gonna pop a Molly. And then, oh, I don't know if I'm gonna try and fuck Molly Cyrus. She doesn't really seem worth it. Oh, deuce. Fucking hole up, dude. I'm looking around for shit. See, look at it. Perfect good rifle ammo right there. What this? Rag. Hold on. More coming or shit? Oh. Okay. Then yes. See, I popped that molly. Okay. Why is there more? Why are there more? I see him. Hello? Oh shit. Eat pipe, bitch. Hello? Okay, Joel, I had that guy. Alright, only goes her leg. <laughs> Why did you have rifle ammo? Joel, what? I think we did it. I think so. Good job, kiddo. So, what do you say we give up on those strings for today? Could have said it better myself. No, we've already come all this way. I want to play some Master of Puppets. Why are there so many? Sub pump. At least it's working now. At least my basement doesn't have fucking water in it. That looks like it might be something. Following you. That'd be kind of the shitty thing. It'd probably be like such a low priority and difficult to like manufacture. Guitar strings in a post-apocalyptic world, you know? Pretty much anything that's existing is all that's gonna exist. <laughs> I mean, you'd have to do some research. I don't really know how strings are made, but I'm sure it's like, you know, there's a core and then you gotta wrap it. Ouch! Ew! He is... Ugly. Well, it shouldn't have been so freaking noisy. Let me pop another Molly. Hold on. Hello. Where's he at? Where's he at? There he is. Hey. One more Molly for you, bud. Ooh, those sounds are- oh my god! <laughs> oh, dude, those sounds are great, dude. That's awesome. I was not expecting that. Holy shit, dude. Bloaters are no joke in this game. Fucking chill, dude. Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Dude, that's fucking awesome. He's like a mega bloater. Oh, Jesus! I can't pop any more mollies, dude. Oh, shit. Well. Okay, that was supposed to happen. I'd be like, I. Ooh. Where'd my mask go?
It was too close. Yeah. Sure. But we fucking did it. <laughs> yeah, we sure did. You good? Uh, ain't nothing to being really old. Ain't nothing solid, not a sleep won't shake off. I want to get out of here. Where'd my mask go? Can I find it somewhere? I like how I like that they souped him up. I think that's good. Where'd my mask go? Where's the whole point? The fact that I'm not supposed to have a mask on. Somebody's gonna fucking catch us. Cause he made a point of it earlier. Like it's going to happen at this point. <laughs> There's like two bloaters back there. It'll be fine. I don't think that would hold two bloaters, but. Spores are clear. Oh. Quite the fight back there, huh? Not often we get a bloater around these parts. Yeah. Jesse and Dina are gonna lose their shit when they hear about this. Let's deal with them two anyway. The date, right? Uh, on and off. Why? Shut up, dog. Why are you barking? No, Jesse and I are just friends. Stop it! No, no, no. I've got a pretty keen eye for these sort of things. Not so keen with this one. Let's see. <laughs> Don't hold your breath. There's my tummy now. Every single possible noise that's happening is happening. That's great. That's great. Can't get any fucking peace and quiet around here. Oh, I thought that was a different gun. I'm like, what? Where the fuck are we even? Bandages on there in real time. That's cool. Oh, yeah. my foot is itchy. Okay. I don't know why, but the bottom, the flat of my foot has been itchy. I don't know why. My legs. Jackson. I think it's them. A couple that ran away last year. Melissa got me this gigantic container of peanut butter filled pretzel bites. So pardon me if I munch on a few of them. Jackson is a wonderful mm. place, but we got tired of hearing the stories of people suffering everywhere else. We wanted to save lives. We had good intentions. We didn't make it an hour before running into a horde. Now we're bitten. We've decided we're going to end our lives instead of turning. Please tell our family and friends that we're sorry. Love Adam and Sydney. Bummer. I shot her. I can't take my own life. I'm a fucking coward. Adam. Jesus. Only they were immune, right? <clears throat> well, let's... Let's go get Tommy and we can get these bodies back to Jackson. Yeah. After you took me out of the Firefly Hospital, 
You said there were dozens of people like me. Yeah. Yeah, that's what they told me. Uh -oh. I've never met another immune person before. Have you? I could be hiding it. You do. Do you believe that? Is now really the time for this? We traveled across the entire country to bring me to the Fireflies. I had so many questions for them. Why did you pull me out of there while I was still unconscious? Because I let them run their tests. And when I saw that they were useless, I got us out of there. How do you know they were useless? Maybe if you, you just would have given them more time, they could have figured Evan. something out. There was no cure. Oh, Jesus. Oh, man. There's nothing that could help these people or anybody else. I know you wish things were different. I wish things were different. But they ain't. And we need to get these kids back to their families. Huh? So you like to be hash. Shit, man. That's heavy. I mean, she knows something's up. Or, like, at least it's something's, like, you know, not adding up. <laughs> Alright, Mom. Jesse's Fucking good. sit. Sit in a chair. Hey. So you can stop stomping around upstairs. He's a good guy. Mm -hmm. Why didn't you tell him? It wasn't the right time. about this? Anything worthwhile? Uh, actually, yeah. Uh, no. This girl, Nora, her unit was assigned to this hospital. They were collecting supplies or something. This hospital? Yeah. Wait, you're gonna go now? Yeah, we have a lead. Like, at least just wait for Jessie to rest up. She could be gone by then. Ellie. We know her location. Maybe Tommy does too. What? Nothing. Good. Can you come help me with the door, please? Easy. 
Sorry I keep bringing up the noise, but like it's like every single like noise that can happen is happening. I've been editing the videos and like it annoys me. Like look at she's walking back again like right now as I speak. It's like oh my god. I don't know, it's just a little bit bothersome. I apologize that I keep bringing it up. <laughs> but it's just like, come on. <laughs> Why are you walking back and forth across, like, right above me? I did say that these are not going to be great commentary tracks anyway, so, whatever. Whatever, dude. Whatever. I will... I'll probably do a little bit of editing and probably cut some of that out or something, just so it's not, like, <laughs> constantly going on in the background, because there's so much noise happening today. I don't know why. play it in the studio just because it's like, you know, like I said, nobody will bother me, but apparently everybody bothers me by <laughs> making noise. Whatever. Good. Who knows how many wolves are at that hospital? I'm gonna say at least 23. Sparking. <laughs> oh man. Okay, progress. Maybe you gotta find a different room. <laughs> okay. So we're going to go to the hospital. <clears throat> I can kind of forgive the flashback that we just experienced a little bit just because... Oh... <sighs> just because like there was a pretty cool encounter with the loader in it. I thought that was pretty neat. Next time, we're about at the end of the episode, so next time on Chinstrap Chap, I'm gonna try and calm down about the fucking noise level. <laughs>